previously on Hell's Kitchen. Get into the water, guys. The chefs were tasked with breaking down lobsters. Oh, yes, I've been breaking down whole lobsters. I can't even tell you how long. Tara on the 40-somethings blue team. Tara, get on the plate. Oh. Struggled to finish hers. Oh, my God. And 20-somethings line cook Summer. This has more attention to detail. Aliana's is butchered. Clawed her way into judging. No legs. Your dish is out. What a shame. The 40-somethings yeah. perfect lobsters totaled. Five. Total redemption. But in spite of Summer's failed lobster, Alejandro. Eight legs. Perfect lobster extracted. And congratulations. Yeah. Clinched the victory for the red team. Go red team. Go red team. Hey. At dinner service. If you're cooking the salmon, halibut, and scallops, what the fuck am I sitting here doing? Summer and Ileana's schoolgirl spat. Nobody running that station. Did not stop the 20-somethings from completing service successfully. Uh, beefy cook the lamb. Thank you, chef. While in the 40-somethings kitchen. Two flatbread, two. Don't confuse me. Billy's behavior. Sorry, Just chef. get in with your tea, will you please? Yes. yes. Nicole's chicken. And the chicken is Wrong. And O'Shea's Wellingtons. The Wellingtons are overcooked. Brought the kitchen to a halt. Get out! They nominated O'Shea and Nicole from the meat station. But in the end, Chef Ramsay sent O'Shea home, ending his dream of becoming head chef at Hell's Kitchen Caesars, Atlantic City. I need to see everybody in the dining room immediately. Later that evening, I am not going to continue serving half the diners in this restaurant. A frustrated Chef Ramsay made a shocking decision. Starting from tomorrow, all the women will be in the red kitchen and all the men will be in the blue kitchen. And now, the continuation of Hell's Kitchen. Now get out of there. Heard chef. Yes, chef. Oh, I did not see that shit coming. No. <laughs> that just fucking changed everything. I can't wait to get a jump on tomorrow. The Young Bucks and the OGs coming together. I mean, the bromance is real here. Yeah. Let's do this, boys. Let's fucking do this. Come on. Let's fucking do this. <laughs> Yo, blue team meeting. We need to step it the fuck up, right? OK? Yeah, we do. What we're going to do, we got to work as a fucking team, though. Yeah. Okay? Absolutely, bro. Absolutely, right? Right now, the blue team is super stinking jazzed. Everybody's on cloud nine. Yo, how's it going to feel that you guys get to go on the rewards? <laughs> <laughs> so the thing that I'm worried about is right now, I'm not confident in this team just because you guys have had a losing streak. So for me, I just need to see you guys on the line and see where you're about. We haven't been on a line in a while. We're owners. So line work has taken a step back for us in our 40s. We are not bad chefs. Oh, yeah. Me, Mindy, and Nicole, we need a win. We need to show the younger girls, the 40-year-olds, can compete at a higher level. We haven't even seen you guys cook. Oh, god. Good morning, Mrs. Tara. I need you to get everybody in their beachwear and out front. Hurry up. Everybody, beachwear right now. Beachwear. 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 Huh? Beachwear? What are we doing? We're going to swim with some sharks? Let's go, let's go, let's go. Blue, 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 I love water parks. I have a season's pass. Actually, the last time I went down a water slide was about three weeks ago. <laughs> but it won't be a day at the beach because it's the start of your next challenge. I'm excited. Now, listen carefully. I want each team to put a real creative spin on four amazing sliders. Beef, chicken, lamb, and salmon. Now, in the pool here, there are hundreds of balls representing ingredients, amazing ingredients. Once you get an ingredient, run over to your team's board and put it next to the protein you want to combine that with. So build it out smartly. Yes, yes chef. The team that can fill all 20 spots, the fastest, wins a very valuable five-minute head start Ooh. in the cook. Oh. Understood? Yes, yes chef. Red team, follow Christina over to the ladders. Thank you. Sliding for sliders? Hell yes. We're little. We can slide down that slide super, super fast. On your mark, get set, go. Go. Oh, careful, careful, careful. Don't trip. 
Go, go, go! Let's go! <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm like terrified. I can feel my heart like pounding in my chest, and the only thing that I'm thinking is I can't let the girls down. Come on, lady, let's go! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> Holy, Holy crap. <laughs> quick, 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 what have you got? Yellow squash. Yellow squash, OK. Let's go. I don't want to panic right now. We're just trying to pair things together that work well with the certain proteins. It's a race, ladies. I got blue cheese. Blue cheese with lamb. Oh, my goodness me. OK, that's weird. I mean, champagne was made from a mistake. You know, maybe blue cheese and lamb does pair well together. You just haven't seen it yet. Come on, ladies. It's a race. OK, we have uh, mango. Come on, you're wasting okay. time. Wow, almost all of them are filled. Let me just put it with chicken. Hopefully, it works out. Dude, they're just throwing the yeah. shit up there, guys. What have you got? Provolone. Work it out, work it out. You got white cheddar and provolone? Don't put two cheeses on the fucking no, slider. No, no cheeses. Either. Let's learn from their mistakes. OK, last spot. Here we go. Persian cucumber. You, only have, you don't have a choice. You got it? Cucumbers. Done, ladies. Well done. Come on, well done. The girls put cucumbers twice and blue cheese with lamb on one dish. Like, what are you thinking? OK, on your mark. Get set, go, let's go. For our team strategy, we're trying not to grab just random ingredients that don't work with the proteins. Go, well, let's go. For the salmon, we want Greek yogurt, cucumbers, things like that. OK, good. English cucumbers on salmon. For the beef slider, you know, we want truffles, we want eggs, we want to go smash burger on that. Good truffle egg, well done, let's go. Watch out, girls, there's waves coming. <laughs> One at a time, guys. Oh, oh my God. God. It is so fun to watch these guys sliding down the slide, knocking to each other. It's like you guys having a bath together, come on. This is a complete shit show in front of us. You got two to go. One more, one more, one more, Greek, for the chicken burger. Let's go. And stop. Well done. Well done. I think we put our ingredients in smart places. We got smart cooks. Can't lose. Now, the team with the fastest time and the winner of the five-minute head start is the red team. Three seconds. It was that close. Right, both teams go and get changed, and I'll see you in the kitchen. I'm not worried at all. Five minutes don't mean nothing if you can't do anything with your ingredients. Yeah, boys, suck that. The girls got one up on you an extra five minutes. How does that feel? Right, ladies, your time starts now. Let's go. In the Hell's Slipping Slider yes. Challenge, Apron's on. two chefs from each team will be working with the same protein and using the same ingredients. Can I use that same pan for my bacon? Hell yeah. Nicole and Summer are each making beef sliders. Fine. I'm nervous cooking a beef slider because last night I was on the chopping block. I'm going to take some bacon fat, and I'm like a little freaked out. I really need to prove that I can win. Guys, this is hot. I'm going to put it down here so I don't have to run. Don't touch it. What direction are you going towards? I'm going to roll this and then pan sear it. Alyssa and Mindy are on the chicken sliders. I think I might roll the mango, too, honestly. Ileana and Daphne are responsible for the salmon sliders. How much black garlic do you think I should put in here? One. While Tara and Cheyenne are handling the lamb sliders. Double cucumbers, a tough one. I have lamb, I have blue cheese, I have two cucumbers. I've got to go with it. OK, brain. At home, I make a stuffed lamb meatball. My clients love it. I'm going to stuff it with some prosciutto, give it some extra fat. I'm kind of having a game plan in my mind. I'm praying it works out. You got this, Gary. You got this. I'll show what we got. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Come on, guys. Get it. While the red team is well on their way with their sliders. Apron's on, apron's on, apron's on. The blue team races to get theirs going with just 30 minutes left. I'm pickle on my cucumbers. Billy and Vlad will be using the same five ingredients to make two unique orders of lamb sliders. You still have the microplane? Uh, yes. Alejandro and Alex will each be responsible for their take on a chicken slider. I'm going to make a hand fried salmon burger. AB and Sakari are on the salmon sliders. And with only seven chefs in the blue kitchen. We've got quail eggs, truffle, and creme fraiche. Really nice. Brett will be the only chef on the men's team cooking beef sliders. So we get into this cook and the boys are buzzing. Coming in, bro. Sorry. But the biggest concern going into this challenge is Billy. Is this thing plugged up? 
Profit, gentlemen. Behind, behind. Sorry, dog. I have a game plan coming into this. I'm gonna make a pesto, and I'm definitely gonna butter up my brioche buns. You know what I'm saying? That's how B True does it. Behind, behind. Five minutes to go. Oh, oh dog. Fire, 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 fire. Kill it. Oh, God. With time running out in the Hell's Slip and Slider Challenge. Five minutes to go. Billy's dream of excelling with his sliders oh. may be going up in flames. Fire, 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 fire. Kill it. Let me turn this flame down. I think that's too burnt. Three minutes, gentlemen. Three minutes. Three minutes. Three minutes. All right, let's go. If you need anything, holler, please. Yes. I need skewers. 60 seconds to go, ladies. Come on, let's go. One minute, guys. There's a bunch of cooking. Shit. Keep working. You only got a minute. Go, go, go. Let's go, guys. 30 seconds to go. Let's go, Mindy. Skewers. Behind. Going to the pass. 20 seconds, guys. Let's go. Get it up to the pass. Coming up, coming up. Five, behind, four, behind. three, two, one, and stop. Well done. Yeah. Well done. I'm only going to be tasting one protein from each team. Now, you've all got 60 seconds to decide which dishes you are dropping. Yes, chef. Hurry up. I don't eat red meat, but I'm super confident in the flavor that I packed in there. I, I, I think mine's going to be good. It's a beef and potato. I'm scared about your salmon since mine is poached. It's going to be a little bit juicier, you know? OK. Are you cool with that? Yes. Yeah, yeah. OK. I know my tzatziki yes. is on point. They're going to love that. Yo, bro, I'm confident in mine. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's the, talk. the only thing is yours look a little bit more dry. You One know, I think guys. the creativity or the pesto. I'll go with this one just because I, like, I like the look of lads. You got it. This is bullshit. I think they're threatened by me. Come on, guys. Right, so, uh, ladies, whose chicken am I tasting? Mine, chef. Gentlemen. Chef, we're tasting mine. Interesting. Whose lamb am I tasting? Mine, chef. Mine, chef. OK, and whose salmon burger am I tasting? Chef, we're, we're going to go with my salmon. Salmon, we decided A, B's. OK. So clearly, Brett's, we're tasting the beef burger. Red tea. It's up to you. Mine, Chef. And I'm just so confused by Summer. Are you OK with that? It's fine. Why are you letting Nicole put her dish up over yours when we know nothing about her other than she blows challenges? OK. So help me judge these sliders. An amazing, award-winning, internationally renowned chef Three Michelin stars. Please, all of you, give a warm welcome for Chef David Myers. Wow. David Myers is incredibly handsome. <laughs> welcome back to Hell's Kitchen. Thanks so much, Chef. We'll be judging your sliders from one to three stars. Shall we start off with the chicken sliders? Let's go. Blue team first, please. Alejandro. I'm so excited to have my food tasted by David Myers. I feel like I knocked it out of the park, so I'm ready to win. Uh, Alejandro, describe your slider. Um, I fried the prosciutto and then candied it, and I essentially made like a quick marmalade caramel sauce. Mm. Well, I like the marmalade idea with prosciutto. Clever. Thank you, chef. Really, really clever. Yes, yeah, chef. And personally, go a bit thicker, because yeah. it's just a little bit too thin. Ready to vote? Let's do it. There we go. Two <laughs> stars. Awesome. Bravo, Thank you. chef. Bravo. Right, chicken red team, Alyssa. Thank you. Hi. Wow, look at that. Uh, so today you have a ground chicken burger. I use the poblano and mango chutney. Tough one, though. Mango in a chicken yeah. slider. Real challenging. Yeah. But I took the challenge, chef, and I made it work. And I, I think it's delicious. I hope you enjoy. I like what you've done with the flavor of the chicken patty. I mean, it really explodes. And the it's mango good. actually works with it. Thank you, chef. I think you've done a great job on this one. Thank you. Pretty good. Yeah. Shall we? Let's do it. Bravo. That was a hard one. Boom, that is mine. It is an A-plus game right there. You needed wow, that. Wow, what a start. See what I can do? Salmon from the blue team. While A.B. tries to post a big score with his salmon slider topped with fried capers and citrus caviar whip. That is good. Thank you, chef. Very good. Shall we? Go, baby! Daphne serves up her poached salmon slider with black garlic and pickled fennel. Pickled fennel. You nailed it. Thank you, sir. Be careful, because it's quite dense inside, and so it's hard. Thank you so much. All right. 
We got this, you guys. We got this. Up next. Vlad, let's go, please. A lamb burger. The blue team has chosen Vlad and his lamb slider topped with spinach to be judged over Billy's pesto lamb slider. The spinach is literally soaking wet. I'm not getting a lot of flavor in the lamb. Thank you, Vlad. Good shot. I am severely her central. Vlad, you pull out a two dog, I told you so, bro. And Tara presents her prosciutto and blue cheese stuffed lamb sliders. So the blue cheese completely wow. overwhelms lamb. Lamb and blue cheese doesn't go together for a reason. Thank you, Chef. Nice try. Yeah. Nice try, Chef. That crushes me. Blue cheese and lamb? I knew it was a risk. Thank you, Tyler. What a shame. But I did not want to be the one to get two stars my first day in the red team. Ladies in the leads, uh, 11 to 12. Wow, this is tough. And it's down to the beef. Blue team, Brett, please come forward and serve David and I. Let's go, Brett! Describe the burgers, please. Um, so you have uh, just a double smash burger slider, and then I fried the quail egg in some black truffle butter. Wow. Now that is what I call a burger. It's decadent. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> I fucking told you, boys. True blue till I die, baby. With the final dish for the red team. Bring up your beef burger. Nicole needs a four to tie and a five to win. I cannot afford to have a repeat of yesterday. You know, I was super confident with the lobster, but I was wrong. I didn't want to make that same mistake again. So it's a meat and potatoes burger. I used um, white cheddar and bacon. I love bacon. <laughs> Who doesn't? It really is meat and potatoes. I think it's clever, it's simple, it's cool, but it's just a bit one-dimensional for me. It just needs a lift. Shall we? Yep, let's do it. You need four to tie, five to win. Congratulations. Um, can I just see the other beef burger? Yes, yeah, chef. Thank you. Describe that for me, please. So I put bacon on the top, and I wanted sweetness, acidity, so I pickled the red onion. I love the crunch. I love the flavor of the bacon with the meat right off the bat. This is delicious. This was a winner. Thank you. Thank you, Chef. Back in line, please. Why didn't I stick up for myself like I normally do? I'm never going to let that mistake happen again. Join me in thanking this incredible chef. Ah. Don't go all the way over. Let's Thank go, you, guys. guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Blue team, I'm closing the doors in Hell's Kitchen tonight. There's no dinner service, so you can enjoy a glorious <laughs> getaway to sunny Palm Springs. Blue, 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 baby. <laughs> Yo, blue team's going to Palm Springs, baby. Yeah. Blue, 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 blue. Man. Oh, ladies. Tomorrow night's menu will feature a very special slider dish. Now, a slider without fries is like a day without sunshine. So we have the most amazing potatoes arriving. Wash them, peel them, cut them, fry them. Yes, yes, chef. yes, chef. Thank you, chef. I feel horrible. I need to stop second guessing myself. I'm just so mad at myself because I always. It fucking hurts me. Like, I know what I'm fucking doing, and like. Why didn't you put it up there then? Because I didn't want to do what I did yesterday. This has more attention to detail. And I'm only just missing legs. No legs. No legs, chef. Unfortunately, your dish is out. I want to learn when to stay back, step back. I didn't doubt it. I knew it. I told her I was 100% confident in my shit. I don't eat beef, but like I know how to fucking season that shit. <gasps> it's fine. <laughs> As the women's first challenge loss is ending in tears. Yeah! Woo! Let's go. The men's first reward is starting with. It's to victory. Cheers. We got the OGs and the young fucks coming together, and the place is so pimped out. True blue for life. True blue, true blue in the donut. Four boxes of potatoes. Got it. It literally freaking sucks. We're gonna finish in at 2 a.m. Damn it, I'm sick and tired of cutting into these. 
at this point, I do kind of feel like I deserve to kind of just sit for a little bit because I did do the best today on today's um, challenge. Uh, ah, don't yawn, bitch. Alyssa right now is on a high horse, which is annoying, and she definitely feels like she shouldn't be doing this right now. I miss, miss my mommy. Let's feast. Oh, oh man. Okay. Can you believe this? It's crazy. Honestly, the only thing I wish is that we could have shared this with, you know, our loved ones. Definitely starting to uh, miss my wife. Don't make me tear up right now. I'm sure we're all missing our wives, you know? I know I miss my wife. You're married? Yeah. You're married. Look how shocked you are. <laughs> are you married? No, I'm not married. You're oh. the only one that's single on the whole team. He has nine <laughs> children. <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome. This is the way the team was supposed to be. I wonder what the red team's doing. <laughs> So let's go through it. Okay. Service has just started. Go. First ticket just came in, table 21. Mm -hmm. Two risotto, one carbonara, flatbread going with a scallop. A weight on, two welly, one New York strip, and a salmon. Yes, yes chef. chef. Two, um, two. Nicole is kind of just someone we're kind of getting a little annoyed with. Can we do the pancetta in advance? Yes. Yeah. We're supposed to do the pancetta in advance. You do not want that pan hot. You're making me nervous, though. You sound really I confused. Am? Yeah, I am. Nicole doesn't have a clue about anything. You about to stay up? Yeah. I'll see you guys in the morning. And I don't need anybody on my team who can't help me if I need them to. You guys. My safe word is, when I'm tripping the fuck out, I need you. It's like, you know, when you're having, like, crazy, uncontrollable sex and you're feeling uncomfortable, and you're like, I need you to slow the fuck down. I need you to say, it's OK, sandwich. Because that's what I tell my dog when she freaks the fuck out. OK? Just say it. <laughs> Wait, yes. just your dog. Just roll with me on this. These thoughts are incredibly disconnected. Do you say that to your dog when you're having uncontrolled sex no. that makes you uncomfortable? <laughs> Nicole has this, this rescue dog called Sandwich. So she told us her safe word tonight is going to be, it's OK, Sandwich. Reel it in, Sandwich, reel it in. <laughs> it's OK, Sandwich. Yeah, like you're comforting an animal. Uh. <laughs> Probably have three hours. So I'm going to change into my new uniform. Yeah, I'm going to wash my face and try to make myself look I'm going to put my Not so tired. In. I could use some Botox. I wanted to get some before I came. And, you look uh, great. Yeah. But since I lost weight, this is dragging, and yeah. this is dragging because my face was so full. Yeah. I've actually lost just over 150 pounds. Somebody legitimately built a Pinterest board that was named Fat Mindy. Mm -hmm. During the time that I was heavy, I was bullied. And so I looked to food as my escape. There was a lot of pain behind that. And of course, I never showed it. I laughed it off because that's what fat people do. Yeah. I didn't want Peyton to see any of that. She was about 10 years old. So she was at a place where it bothered her too because why are you talking about my mom like that? Exactly. You know? I'm starting to break the cycle of lack of self-confidence and I don't feel like it should hold me back anymore. I need to break out of it. Everybody has a different story. Everybody's body's different. Everybody's changes. I'm bigger than I've ever been. I don't care. I'm owning my body. Yeah. Mindy changed careers only like two years ago. There's so much you haven't learned. There's confidence you haven't built yet. But it's nice to see Mindy finding confidence in her ability to cook on the line. I want that moment where Chef says, we have a new leader emerging, and then he calls my name. Like, I think there's a moment, I think, in my life that would probably be the most monumental aside from the birth of my children. As Mindy dreams of brighter days ahead. Oh, boys, welcome home. Welcome back. Home sweet home, fellas. Man, that was awesome. Yeah, baby. The blue team returns refreshed and ready to tackle the next dinner service. Is red team going to win dinner tonight? Yes. yes. Let's go, guys. I'm going to keep drinking water. Is that OK? Why would you ask me if you can drink water? Yes. Fuck yes. Stay hydrated. I'm not incredibly confident in Nicole going into tonight's dinner service. Dude, we're going to kill it. I think she knows what goes in each dish, but I don't think she can follow our tickets. And honestly, I didn't come here to be a fucking babysitter. OK, ready? Matthew. Sir. Open the doors of Hell's Kitchen, please. Yes, Let's go. Once again, Hell's Kitchen is the most sought-after reservation in Los Angeles. Yeah. Yeah. 
As hungry diners peruse the menu, the red and blue brigades prepare for their first night in their new teams. Teamwork makes the dream work, big boy. Focus on garnish. In addition to Chef Ramsay's Hell's Kitchen staples. Can I get a beef Wellington, please? Tonight's appetizer will include a slider with handmade French fries. I'll have the sliders, please. And then I'm going to get my French fries ready. Sexy. This is so cool. And kitchens hope to hit a high note oh. as they're joined by rock legend Skid Row's Sebastian Bach in the blue kitchen. My sister's gonna freak out when she sees that Sebastian Bach is on this. We are such Welcome fans. Sebastian. And high school musicals Corbin Blue in the red. Hi. Hello. How are you guys? We're so excited Wonderful. to have you. Wonderful. So excited. Hi. Thank you for having us. No celebrating to that last fucking ticket. Ladies, we're out the gate first. One slide of special, two scallops. Yeah. Let's go, ladies, please. Five minutes on sliders, please. I need you to do something more than this, dude. OK, OK, I'm going to go. Thank you. What do you need? Do you need anything? Let's go, ladies, please. Coming into dinner service tonight, I have an opportunity to prove myself to the red team and show them that I have every reason to be here. Mindy, shake the pan out. Let's go. Yes, chef. Push it in there. Because you can. Good. Lovely color on there. Beautiful Thank you, color. Chef. Look. And then all together in one. All nice and straight. Yes, Beautifully yes. cooked. Thank you. Nice. Walking sliders. Let's go. Dude, this is really fun. Service, please. With Mindy Scallops getting her team off on the right foot, it's time for the Blue Kitchen to start on their first appetizer order of one carbonara, one slider special. Let's go. Yes, yes, Three minutes out on the carbonara. Cost is dropped. Hey, let's just make it five for me, OK? Five on we're, sliders. We're waiting on sliders. Everything goes through garnish, so you have to step up as a leader. You have to set the tone. You're the one that never stops running your fucking mouth. Don't finish it until I say I'm 100% good on these, but I, I think two and a half. Two and a half. You got it. You have to be the one that knows everything that's going on. Because let's not fuck this up. we got to keep a good momentum. This is so surreal. That 90 seconds works for you? Yes. Where are the sliders? I'm good to walk. Slider. We're walking on sliders. Walking slider. Carbonars up. Can I get anybody anything? Can I do anything for anyone? Oh, come on, guys. I'm not cooked. Hey, Brett, come here. Come here, you. Now I've got fucking ice cold, fucking raw sliders. Raw, dude. Yes, Chef. This is a big fucking mistake. Oh, my God. How did I just send up raw sliders to Chef Ramsay? Raw fucking meat. That's fucking ice cold. I don't get it. Come on. It's 30 minutes into dinner service. And in the blue kitchen. Hi, Brett. Brett's sliders are raw meat. That's fucking ice cold. I don't get it. He's giving me stuff that's fucking raw. One more slider. Yes, Chef, I won't rush again, Chef. How long for slider? Five minutes, Chef. Start the fucking appetizers again. Yes, Chef. Yes, Chef. I knew better than to do that. I'm cheesing right now. I send up raw ones, and I'm wondering if I just blew my shot at this executive chef job in Atlantic City. Yeah, carbonara. Carbonara's up. Walking slider. Very nice. Service, please. With Brett's sliders finally being delivered. That is good. And blue diners enjoying them, both kitchens have found their momentum on appetizers. Walking scallops, walking. Wow, they're perfect. <laughs> Are we allowed to tell them we love it or what? OK, ladies, table four, entree to lamb to New York strip. Yes, sir. Let's go. We made it to the entrees, guys. New York strip. Six minutes on that, guys. Six minutes, OK? Kurt, I don't know what you're doing right now. Uh, I'm working these two strips for this fire, so I just okay, got to Are these lamb going in the oven? Yes, they are. It's hard when you're leading, but you also need somebody to follow your lead and also, you know, help you out. I need you to help me a little bit more, please, OK? I'm, yeah, I'm learning, too, and you don't need to push like that. I got it. Summer is not working with me as a team at all. Let me check on that small lamb. That's no, it's not ready yet. I've got a time on it. It's not okay. ready. But I can handle anything that's thrown at me. Going up, two strips. Come on, I'm here. Sorry, chef. It's a hot plate. Of course it's fucking hot. It's a kitchen. Lamb? All right, you're confident. Can I walk with the lamb? Yeah, let's go. We're up. Just put it down. <laughs> fucking hell. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. All of you. Yes, chef. Back room, now. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Deja vu. This is my first night with the red team, and we're in the freaking storage room. What in the fuck is happening? I can't even slice that. It's that raw. I don't know where to go anymore. You've given up. 
and you've given up. How do I get this? Shit! I, t I, I don't know what to do! Get fucking organized! Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got this, guys. We're gonna bounce back. Bounce back! I'm posted up next to Meat Station, and I can see they are literally going down in flames. No more. No more errors. Let's go. I'm order a four cover seven twenty three. Entree two lamb two halibut. Yes, 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 yes. Let's go. I need six on halibut. Burn. Go ahead and pop that lamb, lamb in. The last two dinner services, the meat station is actually what got us kicked out of the kitchen. So please, God, don't let that happen to me. OK, Alex, pick it up. My lamb is resting. Halibut, please, Vlad. Vlad. No answer. He just turns away. I find that the height of bad manners. That's fucking rude. Do you understand? Vlad, he's talking to you, bro. When you fucking stand there and just blank me, what the fuck? It's strange. Strange behavior. Chef definitely wants people who are loud and can take charge and be the boss. Four minutes, right? We said four? Four minutes. All right, let's do four. And Vlad's kind of shown a little bit of deer in the headlights, a little bit of lack of confidence. He's starting to howl a bit. I feel I'm rested. No, Chef. Hey, come here. Come here. Yes, chef. If I was running the meat, I'd tell you to shut the fuck up. Yes, Chef. Why are you telling me about his lamb? I don't know, Chef. So can I talk to the fucking chef that's in charge of the lamb? Oh, shut up, Chef. How long for the lamb? Four minutes, Chef. Ooh, Brett, you gotta be careful. You can't get on Chef's nerves. I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be quiet over here. To the right. Halibut down. I am. Come on. Hot sizzle. Beautifully cooked the lamb. Thank you, Chef. Service, please. With Chef Ramsay sending out Alex's lamb. Very well done. Oh, it's amazing. The diners are impressed with the blue team's first entree of the evening. Walk it to the window. A, B. Yes, Chef. That's an A on the meat. I was always a D and an F kind of person. Chef, to your left. Service, please. Go, let's go, let's go. But in my cooking, I found a passion to where I can make straight A's and uh, make the D's list. Let's go, let's go, let's go. With A.B. and Alex excelling on the meat station. Oh, so good. Like milk in your mouth bowl. The blue team only has two more tables of entrees to complete. My glasses are in go mode. Fire. On order, four cups of table 33. You guys it up. Three salmon, one Wellington. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. I'll take care of the salmon. Wellington. Going in the oven right now, chef. I need three minutes. Yes. I'm really trying my best. We need this. This new red team needs a win. How long? Three salmon, one Wellington, please. These pans are too hot. Oh, Fuck it. Hot. Three salmon, one welly. How long? I'm sorry, I fucked up those. How long? How long? I need four minutes for that, chef. So another four minutes? Yes, chef. Can I ask why? Because I ran out of salmon. I'm sorry. So you've run out of salmon. You didn't run out of salmon. You just cooked all the salmon. Yes, chef. So I'm there's, sorry. There's, there's a difference. We haven't run out. I can't just pick a fucking salmon. Do you have any salmon on you? Do you bring a fresh? No, I mean. I, you just can't pluck a salmon from the fucking air. Chef, I was using the bottom pants because I, I ran out. I don't care. OK, I'm sorry about that. I still need four minutes. Oh, my god. There's, hey, there's just no momentum in here. Blue team. Yes, Chef. Come here, you. Oh, my god. Hey. It's 90 minutes into dinner service. I am. You can cook the lamb. Thanks, Chef. And while the blue team is close to the finish line, I ran out of salmon, I'm sorry. Oh, my God. The red team is stuck in neutral. So you ran out of salmon. You didn't run out of salmon. You just cooked all the salmon. Yes, chef, So there, there's, there's a difference, because yeah, you screwed it. So we haven't run out. Blue team. Yes, chef. Come here, you. Come on, boys. Right. Blue team, take over. Fire, let's go. Three salmon, one Wellington. Away. Yes, yes, chef. Let's go. The red team's going down. The girls are burning up in flames. Like, he wants us all to bail these chicks out. What the hell is going on, Red Team? You guys have no more salmon. You have no more, more salmon. salmon. We got this one salmon. Guys, get me salmon from the other side. I'm so embarrassed. I'm heated right now. I'm pissed. I'm fine. Yeah. I got it. OK, I'm going to stand here next to you. You don't need to stand next to me. I, I got it. I know this is not my fault. Like, Daphne, Summer, and Alyssa, okay, okay, okay. can you not work without these boys holding your hands? I need six minutes. Six minutes. Six minutes. Are you ladies watching or are you going to jump in? Yeah. Sam is working. OK, so we're good then. They done messed up. For the red team, they give us that look like, get the hell out of my kitchen. Well, guess what? Chef Ramsay told us to come over here, move the hell out my way. 
Butter. Where was the butter that was right here? I did not grab it, dude. These feel good. Yep. Go. Salad. Sandwich chef. Service, please. With the blue team successfully bailing out a drowning red team. Come through, chef. Come through. Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. It's tough right Thank you. The last few red tables finally get their entrees. Really good. Oh my god, that just melts in your mouth. I know, that's crazy. Thank you, blue team. Yes, yes chef. chef. Momentum, finally. Ladies, what happened there? We just went down, chef. Went down? We didn't get up. I'm so sorry. We did not get up. Get upstairs and try and do something as a team for the first time tonight and have a really good discussion. Forget one. Forget two nominees, three individuals that you consider the weakest. Hurry up. Yes, yes chef. chef. Having to put up three nominations, this is extremely tough. If it were all up to me, I would put up one person from meat and one person from fish. But this third nominee is really, I feel like it's really going to hurt some feelings. I think he's going to want to see somebody from fish up there. I hustle my ass yes. off. Chef said the weakest, though. Yes, that we... he said oh, weakest, weakest chef. Decision. Daphne has worked other services, and she has not gone down under pressure. And I was doing good in yeah, the beginning, you were doing, like, you get, you're, no you're not the weakest. You're not the weakest. Was, no. You were I trying. I know it fucking sucks, because it looks like I can't cook fish now. No, like, it doesn't. No, no, no. We know, no, we know no, what no. happened. Today you went down, but this was the only time that you did. So let's be honest. I think he wants to see Meat Station up. I agree, he, he wants to see Meat, Alyssa, and Summer up there. Meat just started off with the lack of communication, and that yeah. sucked. I needed more communication from my partner. I'm not trying to throw you under the bus, but you were not giving me that. I was still trying, and you weren't meeting me halfway. All I'm going to say is, is like, I have showed some strengths in this competition. Yeah, I know you, I'm you a know good what? cook. I know I don't deserve to go home because I have proven myself in every other aspect of this competition. I know I fucked up tonight. But again, we were all really worried about Nicole going to the service. And like, I feel like we shouldn't have to be dwelling on somebody yes. before going into a service. Yeah. Listen, I didn't get yelled at at all. Yeah. It's not my fault if you guys went down tonight. Nicole is the weakest chef. She did not take any initiative. She just kind of got in the way on garnish today for Eliana. Well, I do want to be here. I came here to learn. We're here to win, not to learn. No, I'm here to win as well. I'm not just like, oh, floating around. I'm not. Nicole, just because I feel like you didn't step up as much as all of us did. Yeah. Like, this competition is too intense for you. Yes. And you weren't supporting us today. You were just yeah. hiding. I don't want to fucking leave. How the fuck am I the weakest chef? They failed on their own. I didn't give that up. I think he's going to say, why the fuck is Nicole up here tonight? Because did we see Nicole fail during a service yet? And then we're going to look stupid as fuck. Ladies, have you reached a consensus on the three weakest chefs. Yes, yes chef. chef. Ileana, Red Team's first nominee, and why? Chef, our first nominee is Alyssa. She sent you up raw lamb. She didn't communicate with her partner, and the meat station just fell apart tonight. Second nominee, and why? Chef, our second nominee is Nicole. We felt that she had a lot of opportunities to step up tonight. Assistance was needed all around the kitchen, and it, it just wasn't there. Ileana, third nominee for the weakest chef on the red team. Chef, our third nominee is Mindy. She was on fish station tonight. That went down pretty hard. And I haven't heard her voice much during service. Melissa, Mindy. Nicole, step forward, please. Nicole, second time up here. Why should you stay in Hell's Kitchen? I was prepared for this evening. I didn't ask whether you're prepared or not. I'm asking you, why should you stay? Because I won't give up. Did you cook anything on garnish tonight? I started, I did start. Um, all of the garnishes for salmon and for lamb. Is that true? Chef, she dropped a few orders of fries for me, and then after that, I didn't see much of her. It felt like you were hiding tonight. 
Mindy. What happened tonight? Chef, I, I was, I did lose my voice and my confidence shook a little bit, but I'm not the weakest chef on this team. I, I hustle hard and I grind harder and I want nothing more than to make you proud. What about making yourself proud? Alyssa, how did you get so lost tonight? I should have taken more of a leadership role. It was miscommunication. There should have been better communication between me and my partner. I should have just voiced my own opinion and taken more of a leadership role. This is really difficult. The chef leaving Hell's Kitchen is... Nicole. Young lady, give me a jacket. Thank you, chef. The last time you were in front of me, you gave me a passionate plea. And tonight, all night, from the beginning, in the middle to the end, I didn't feel that passion. Give me a jacket, please. Good night. Thank you. I feel a little disappointed, but I'm a little disappointed in the girls. I feel that I was abandoned by them. I mean, all of them failed. I did not. Not tonight. So that's on them. But it's OK, Sandwich. Mama's coming home. Back in line. Thank you, Chef. Get some sleep, because you're going to need it. I'm ready to show Chef Ramsay my bounce back and show the rest of the team, like, hey, I had a fuck up tonight, but guess what? You're not going to be able to use this against me. I'm disappointed, but everybody's going to have to fight for their life sometime. And tonight was my night, and it's the last one until the finals. Your boy's on fire. The momentum's built, and the girls have something to worry about. The blue team's coming to kick some ass. With her team struggling, Nicole decided to hide instead of help. That's all I needed to see. Next time on Hell's Kitchen. When the fire alarm sounds. Ah, this is crazy! Will the chefs be able to answer the call? Come on, let's go then. We've got to speed up. Or will the chefs turn on each other? we got to talk a little better. I'm talking. Every component on the plate, Alyssa. Summer needs to lose the attitude. And will a brutal punishment. Today is trash sorting day. You are going to stink. Have the chefs down in the dumps. <laughs> I'm not ready to go. And ready to talk trash. Don't come over yeah, here and jump in my I, way. You have a very strong personality. He does think he's better than me and smarter than me. Find out. I don't give a shit. I'm better than him. On a down and dirty episode. <laughs> Help me fucking out. I am going to cut somebody. Of Hal's Kitchen.